Hello all you awesome people out there, my name is Akira and welcome to this let's play of The Stanley Parables. And uh, this is the demo of the game that is uh, free of Steam. Um, because the game actually costs money on Steam, so, but um, I have both of them, so I think I will play both of them, but I will show off the demo first um, of it. Uh, it was my intention actually to play um, Donkey Kong Country 2 today, but for some reason the recordings I made of it. Uh, the sound was missing for some reason. It 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 it, it disappeared halfway through my um, video, uh, my recordings. So I actually have to rec record that part again. Uh, but I don't have the time for it right now uh, because I have to play from the beginning of the game because I have saved later on, so I can't get back to the levels where I were before. And yeah, that means that I have to play something else until I can get to record it again. So I am truly sorry about that, but um. Yeah, let's try this out instead. So now we are loading. Um, I have played um, the Stanley Parables before, so and the demo, but it's still a lot of fun because I haven't found everything there is in the game. Uh, the demo, I think you can only complete one way, but uh, the other one is <sighs> so much longer. Stanley Parables demonstration, and I really love that. It's just when you start off, your fingers the screen, but nope, it's a sign. Um, but yeah, the game looks a lot, if, uh, for those who know, um, in the jungle there was a tiger or something it's called. Uh, I'm not 100% sure about the title, um, but it has a longer title. Um, but it's that kind of, um, you go on an adventure and have a narrative that is talking to you. So, but um, yeah, you would hear that in just a second when I get, how the hell does these cards get in here at all? There's no, well. Game designers, who how did that happen? I can't even remember. Stanley Parables demonstration this week. This dark. There's missing some panels on the ceiling. Uh, door locked. Other door locked. Okay. Welcome to the Stanley Parable demonstration. Your number is 28. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you, and have a pleasant demonstration. Thank you. So my number is 28. Okay, I am... Um, receptionist, one. there is only one receptionist, but um, it's my turn, so I think I have to go through this door. Um, <laughs> I can't even go through a door. Crap. No, 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 no. Okay, so but then we are here. Okay, so... What is this paint? Oh, there is nothing. This just boarded up. I think there's windows, maybe. Rating room. Please wait for your number and then enter. Thank you. Um, someone has spilled this coffee over here. Can I crouch? Yes, Alex, you can. What is this? Stanley Parable End? A demonstration. Demonstration, okay. <laughs> I couldn't see all that. So my number is 28, so I have to wait for my number. Or can I just walk through? Screw you! I'm number 26. Famous demos. So this one looks like. Oh, what is the name of that game? Um, I think I've seen the game like it before. I can't remember the name now. Um, then we have Solid Snake and I think maybe Half-Life or Gary's Mod. I'm not sure about that one. And I don't know that one. I can't remember this one. So, But I played the game. I know that for a fact. Uh, I played it. But it's a really long time ago, so I can't remember what it is. So let's go up and see. Oh, hello, hello, hello! Welcome to the Stanley Parable live demonstration. Thank it you. will be my pleasure to guide you through this sneak peek at what to expect in the Stanley Parable. A tease, just enough to leave you hungry for more. How exciting! Can't you just feel that nervous tension? The looming uncertainty? Why don't we drink in the anticipation for a moment, just for 20 minutes or so? 
Eh, I, I don't want to. For just 20 minutes, don't move or act in any way. Simply remain motionless and let the thrill of demoing the Stanley Parable wash over you. Oh, I get it. You're uh, too anxious. You can barely hold still. Well, yeah. I'll tell you what. I think we should walk off that nervous energy before getting the demo underway. Okay. Here, why don't I take you on a little tour of the facility and show you how we make a demonstration for a game like the Stanley Parable. Okay. I actually, <laughs> I'm curious now. Of, um, I will probably play the demo again and just wait in 20 minutes and see what's happening. But um, not right now. Right now I will just <laughs> go on here. This is where I and the other proctors have been working meticulously to construct a demo that explains clearly and concisely exactly what the Stanley Parable is, how it plays, and why you should spend real-world money on the main game. <laughs> Video game demonstrations are tricky, and without the proper technology, you run the risk of the player having no idea what to expect in the full version. Well, he is right about that. I have bought some games where I will really get disappointed because the videos for it actually was not that good. Uh, it was good, and then the game was just sucky, like dread out. <coughs> the demo for that game was really epic, and the game was just yeah. I played it on my channel, but I didn't complete it because um, it was bad. So, but let's go around here and down to that door. It doesn't seem like a jump, so I can't really go any other way than this. Crap is dark in here. Ah, here is one such technology. These buttons are meant to convey the meaning of choice and the impact of the decisions you make. After all, choices carry tremendous meaning and consequence. Didn't you know that? Go ahead. Why don't you try picking one of these buttons to press and we'll see what your choice says about you. Okay. Um, eeny, meeny, miny, moo. Um, can I get the one up in the top there? No, oh, okay. Then I take this one. How fascinating. Did you know that 94% of all people who select that particular button are sexual predators? You see, our choices really do illuminate the very intangible nature of our minds and souls. Pervert. Um, that seems about right. I played Honey Pop. Can I press any more buttons? I'm actually curious if um, they say anything else when it press. Again, I have played the demo, but it's such a long time ago, I can't even remember this. But I'm really curious if they say anything other than... I, I will check it out later. Uh, okay. myself. What else can I show you then? Then, then. This place is the, the buffalo fuck? of game design. Nothing is wasted. Um, the game lacked a little there. Okay. Wall technology. Let's go in and see. Now, I think you'll find this exciting. We've actually developed a wall that you can walk through. Go ahead. Give it a shot. Oh. Hmm. Guess it's still in development. Right. Okay, moving along. <laughs> Wall the Buffalo is still in development. Well, but I'm curious if that actually is something in the game also. How's the anticipation? Still feeling it? Yeah, I think. Uh, what do we have here? Demos, status. This device tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. Somewhere around here, there's also a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. Oh. Are you that eager for the demo to start? Don't worry, we're almost there. Thank you. Um, what's up here? Compliments. One of the most important parts of administering any demonstration is pumping up your ego and appealing to insecurities about your sense of self-worth. That's why we use this room to develop cheap compliments to shower on the player during the demo. Thank you. Go ahead and press that button to see some of the superficial flattery we've been cooking up. Why is that upside down? My heavens, I've never met someone who can consume as much uranium in a single sitting as you can. Just look at you go. The hook. Of all the people I know who are playing this exact demo at this exact moment and standing in this exact room, your performance is easily in the top 5,000. Top 4,700 even. 
I won't go as far as 4,600. Mm. Oh. Uh, let's see. Oh, this is embarrassing. I really can't think of anything else to say. Uh, no, no. You've really exhausted my list of compliments. Goodness, that was fast. Either you or this department has a lot of room for improvement. Okay, yeah. then. What's next? Um, that was um, not that many compliments. There were two. Anyways, on Earth. So, we have been through those doors. Um, is there anything down here? Nope. Is that over there? I can't even read it properly. So, what do we have here? Emotion boost. Now, here's what we use to convey story. These booths convert text from a story into raw emotion. Go ahead, step into one of them, and feel the sheer power of narrative exposition. So, discovery or despair? Let's start with despair. Where did these cliffs go? These crags that we stood upon, they shielded us from our own ignorance, spoke coddling words, and wrapped our vulnerabilities in a woolen cloth that so many times I tried to set aflame. If I knew these comforts now, would their fibers be any more sensitive to the heat of my touch? Perhaps it was the cold I desired most of all. That empress to he whom was... my flesh was always invisible. A hammock for the bones, waiting to be touched and to be known. Okay. Um, let's try this one. It was though and within the shame he carried that ocean breeze did drift. The fierceness of the tides, the inevitable collapse of their kingdoms, washed ashore, bereft of shame, martyrs devoid of a cause, ripping and tearing at the eternal seams. A vessel without a captain, carrying itself like plastic in the wind, hinting at a purpose that was truer in some distant memory, if only it could decipher through time's veneer whose memory it wanted to be. Okay, on roof. That was um, something. Oh, you went in both booths? Oh, how vulnerable of you. If at any point during the demo you need to cry, just let me know and we can take a minute. <laughs> uh, he's fantastic to listen to. Final choice. Ah, now this room is perhaps the most important you'll encounter in the demo. This is where we determine whether or not the demo has been effective. Whether it's... No! What are you doing? You can't make that decision yet. You haven't played the demo. We've put so much work into this demonstration. Wouldn't it be a shame if you rushed right into making a purchasing decision without savoring it first? No. Let this one simmer. You'll have plenty of time to decide later. I didn't get to what you said before, but I think it's the most important one because I have to decide if I like the demo. Well, then I'll come back later. Exit. And there you have it. Everything you need to know about how video game demos are made. Okay, thank you. So... However, it's still important that we address safety concerns. Please closely observe the following possible negative side effects of playing the Stanley Parable. If you agree to be held 100% responsible for any and all injury or long-term damage, mental, physical or otherwise, that may occur while playing the demo, please do not press the large red glowing disagree button at this time. Nothing? No objections? You're quite sure about that? There's no button. Well, all right then. In the event that you do experience one or all of the previously listed symptoms, let's establish a signal for you to convey to me that you wish the demonstration to be terminated. Please step into the dance perimeter. Please perform a dance. I'm dancing. Your dance has been recorded. Okay. In the event that you feel confused or disoriented by anything you see inside the demo, perform that dance and I will terminate the demo immediately. Right. All preparations have been made. It is time at last. Are you prepared for the Stanley Parable? Yup. Ah, finally. Wow. That is bright. 
Dancing, dancing, determinate. Oh, I not inside the thing yet. I mean, here we go. I am. Oh wait, what? What are we doing Welcome here? Welcome to Did the Stanley Parable demonstration. Your number is twenty-nine. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you, and have a pleasant demonstration. Thanks. Um, okay. Okay, uh, I'm lost. Let's just get back to the green room and start the demo again. I must have done something wrong the first time. Yes, yeah, but then, then we're doing that. It's up here. Okay, here we go. The Stanley Parable Demo Take 2. Finding the demo, learning exactly what the Stanley Parable is. Here it comes. Yay. The Stanley Parable. Oh, wait. What's this? Uh, a button. Eight. Eight. Wait, 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 wait. It's This is all wrong. This isn't the Stanley Parable. This is a game where you press a button and it says eight. Not only eight. is the Stanley Parable not a game about continuously pressing the eight. number eight, I can eight. guarantee that eight. this button does not appear eight. anywhere in the main game. Eight. Why is it here eight. instead of the demo for the Stanley eight. Parable? Eight. Where did the demo go? Eight. There was an actual ah. demo here before. Something has gone wrong. It's all gone horribly wrong. We need to get you out of here before you start forming impressions of the Stanley Parable based on whatever the hell this egg game is. We need to get out. We need to start over. You mustn't stay here another minute. Out, out, out. Go, okay. go, go. I'm, I'm out. Gee. Imagine if this had been the demo. What would you have been thinking? You'd have left with no idea what the Stanley Parable is about. None whatsoever. Oh, but I can't get in again. Well, then we're going back to the receptionist. Can I sprint anything? No, I can go on crouch. Well, that was um something. Welcome to the yes, Stanley yes, Parable yes, demonstration. Time. Your number is thirty. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you, and have a pleasant demonstration. Uh oh, I can't trigger it when I go through again. Down. Um, yeah, let's just um, go back to the call out. Okay, now let's take a minute to get something straight here. When you sit down to play this demo, you are assuming an amount of responsibility for its outcome. Now, I can't say for certain whether you caused us to encounter the eight game rather than the Stanley Parable, but I think it's a pretty safe assumption that you had something to do with it. At this time, please take a minute to think about all of the mistakes you've made in playing this demonstration, as well as your lack of respect for demo taking in general. <laughs> think about mistakes. Keep going. Dig your love. Okay, wrap it up. Wonderful. I could really feel the introspection on my end. Now that we're all on the same page again, I feel ready to attempt the demonstration once more. In this third attempt, we shall truly come to understand the meaning of the Stanley Parable. Yay. Let the demonstration begin. Thank you. Uh, only crab is dog in here. Where am I? Oh, what? Can't be over yet. You didn't see anything. Everything that was supposed to demonstrate why the Stanley Parable is a quality experience worth your time and money. <laughs> it was here somewhere. I'm sure of it. Oh no 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 no. We have to get out of here. We have to find something for you to do. Anything. The demo cannot end like this. Now hurry, hurry this way. Okay. Okay. Yes. Starts. This is new. This is different. Surely there must be a game somewhere in here. Okay, okay. Oh, how about this cup? Yes, go pick up the cup. All right, now put it, um, um, in the bin. Okay. You did it! 
You won! Yay! You know what you get for winning? An achievement. Wow, the Stanley Parable just keeps getting better and better. In fact, let me take a little survey of your experience. Based on what you've played so far, would you purchase the Stanley Parable? Uh, I don't... What is it? You responded, What a clear and straightforward demonstration of the merits of the Stanley Parable. I am convinced of the quality of the full game. Incredible. You really do get it. You understand. Oh, I was so worried. <laughs> I just oh, wanted you okay. to know what I see in the Stanley Parable. What I think makes it, well, special. It's so very difficult to put into words. <sighs> oh, we're all beyond that now, aren't we? <laughs> Come along. Let's get to the end and the final choice. Okay. Um, what the hell? Oh, yeah. Ending, ending. Where are you? Where are you? Oh yeah, and, and the achievement I got was um, called video game or something. I did. I don't know if they actually shows up in my recording. So, funny enough, I didn't get it last time. But what the hell? Is this it? Uh, Maybe. Yes, the end. Now this is where we want the demo to be over. And I think it's time for you to log your final decision as to whether or not the Stanley Parable is any good. And it all comes to this. Please consider very carefully before answering. Much is at stake. Do you like the Stanley Parable? I actually enjoy it a lot, uh, but I think just for the funniest, uh, funny fun of it, I press no. I can't. Is it working? I. No. Are you sure? Oh. You sure you press the button? Love. What? No. We, we finished the demo. Did it start again? Hello. Is anyone there? They already finished. They said they liked it. I need someone to stop the demo. Hello? We need to go back. We need to get out of here. What the hell? What the fuck? Oh no, what's going on? Where is everyone? Okay, over to the left. Down this way. Ah, I can go through the buttons. Something is horribly wrong. Okay, I'm, I'm out of here. Okay. Whew. Oh, nice and well, quiet. This is nice. Finally. Well, I suppose we can both agree that I failed, haven't I? My job was to be a teacher, and I so badly wanted to teach you exactly what the Stanley Parable is supposed to be, but, but somehow I couldn't. I, uh, it's okay. Well... Not your fault. At any rate, I don't know if I care for the Stanley Parable anymore. Do you think any of this is actually in the main game? No. Nope. Honestly, I doubt it. What would that even look like? No. I think I've had enough of it. No more doors. No more demonstrations. No more endings. That's the other problem with this game. There's too many bloody endings. I'm sick of them. How can one game end so many times? It doesn't make sense. Oh, but back at the beginning of the demonstration, now oh, that was lovely. No concerns about where it was all going. No confusion. Just a blank slate. Yes, that's what I want. A game of beginnings. Hey, <laughs> do you remember, just a few minutes ago, when we met for the first time, and I showed you the technology used to make the demo, because I thought there actually was a demo. Oh, oh. <laughs> Oh, what the we were so naive back then. How little we knew of the world. And then, when we ended up back in the waiting room, even though you'd already done that before... Yes! It's <laughs> what so fresh in my memory. They were such wonderful moments. Oh, and then when we played the game with the cup and you won, and then we kept wandering and we ended up in a stairwell somewhere, and Wait, we just what? kept climbing and climbing, flight after flight after flight. I thought they would never end. And then we were on some kind of catwalk. I didn't have any idea what was down there. Did you? And we just kept going and we found that elevator and it said escape on it. And we talked about it for a while, about how we couldn't possibly know whether this was really an escape, but that it seemed uh. worth a try, and at the very least it would be an adventure. So we got inside and we rode the elevator up and up and up, 
We had some sense that the end was coming, but we couldn't possibly know when. And then after so long, it finally stopped, and we stepped out into the lush outdoors. The trees, the wildlife, the sun rising on a new and glorious path. Freedom. We were free. There was nothing to think, nothing to know. I don't remember that. Simply this. us being right there in that moment. Wasn't it so beautiful? What have you drank? Wasn't that moment so singularly, piercingly beautiful? We were free. What have you eaten? Well... <sighs> <laughs> and then it ends. Oh, god dang it. And yeah, it's out now, so... And this is this, I will boss team. So... Anything else? Or is that, uh... Give me a background talking? No. Okay, we're back. So, that was the uh, standard parable to the demo. Um, as I said, I think I'm playing the main game also a couple of times just to show off some of the endings because there's a lot of them and I have not found all of them at all. But yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this um, little teaser for the Stanley Parables even though it was around an, uh, half an hour. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed it instead of Donkey Kong. Um, I will get back to Donkey Kong as soon as I have um, the ability to record it. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. You can give it a thumb up if you did. You can give it a thumb up if you did, you can give it a thumb up if you did, I can't talk. You can give it a thumb up if you did, you can hit me up on Facebook or Twitter or write a comment down below. You can subscribe for more videos and I hope you all will have an awesome day. And until next time, farewell. No? But here... Yeah, yeah, shut up. I'm coming now. I see I do a lot of damage to these guys by doing the elemental attack. And I rank down.